Hi, everybody, and welcome to the 2021 State Awards presentation. Uh, my name is Katie Foley, and I am the State Director for the High School Division. Um, first and foremost, coaches and event supervisors, I just have to extend a huge thank you for making not only the season possible, but our state tournament possible. Coaches, I appreciate all of you who worked hard to facilitate a team for your school this year. Um, if you also took on an event yesterday um, to either write the test, proctor, grade, whatever it may be, run a build event, um, I just appreciate your time and effort that um, you gave to the program yesterday in order to have a really successful experience for students this year, given our wonderful COVID circumstances. Students, I have to give you a big thank you for participating in Science Olympiad this year. I know that it hasn't been ideal, but I am seeing such a level of dedication, um, as same as if we were in person. And so I just appreciate all of the effort that you've been putting forth this year, and I hope that you have found this year to be successful and rewarding, despite um, not being able to compete in person. So we're going to do results for both JV and varsity. Um, each event will have the JV awards first and then followed by the varsity. For JV, we are going to award medals to the top three teams. And for varsity, we will award medals to the top four teams. After the individual events, we will get into the team results. Um, all medals and trophies will be mailed directly to your school um, based on the address that you've provided us. And so that will come right from nationals. There could be a little bit of a time delay as they work to fulfill orders. So it should show up uh, within the next month or so. All right, let's get to it. So first up, we have anatomy and physiology for JV. And in third place, we have Eden Prairie. Second place, Mounds View. And first place, Wyzetta. For anatomy and physiology varsity, in first pla fourth place, Moorhead. In third place, Eden Prairie. Second place, Mounds View. And first place, Wyzetta. For astronomy JV, we have Century in third, Mounds View in second, and Wyzetta in first. For astronomy varsity, we have Century in fourth, Blake in third, Mayo in second, and Eden Prairie in first. Chemistry lab for JV, third place Wyzetta, second place Century, and first place Eden Prairie. For chemistry lab varsity, we have fourth place Eden Prairie, third place Wyzetta, second place Mounds View, and first place Minnetonka. For circuit lab JV, third place Mounds View, second place Wyzetta, and first place Mounds View. For Circuit Lab Varsity, we have fourth place Woodbury, third place Mayo, second place Eden Prairie, and first place Wyzetta. Code Busters JV, third place Mounds View, second place Wyzetta, and first place Eden Prairie. Code Busters Varsity, fourth place Eastview, third place Eden Prairie, second place Wyzetta, and first place Mounds View. Designer Jeans JV, in third place, Eden Prairie, second place, Mounds View, first place, Mounds View. For designer jeans varsity, we have Woodbury in fourth, Century in third, Wyzetta second, and Mayo in first. Detector building JV, Eden Prairie in third, Mounds View second, and Mounds View first. Detector building varsity, fourth place, Woodbury, third place, Century, Second place, Wyzetta, and first place, Mayo. Digital Structures, JV. Third place, Wyzetta, second place, Mounds View, and first place, Mounds View. Digital Structures, Varsity. Fourth place, Eden Prairie, third place, Mounds View, second place, Wyzetta, and first place, Century. Disease Detectives, JV. East View in third, Mounds View in second, and Eden Prairie in first. Disease Detectives Varsity, Eden Prairie in fourth, Century third, Blake in second, and Mayo in first. 
Dynamic Planet JV, YZ a third, Eden Prairie second, and Mounds View first. Dynamic Planet Varsity, fourth place goes to Century, third place Eden Prairie, second place YZ, and first place Egan. Experiment in Data Analysis, JV, third place Century, second place Mounds View, and first place YZ. Experiment in Data Analysis, Varsity, we have YZ in fourth, Egan in third, Mounds View in second, and Minnetonka in first. Forensics JV, Century third, Mounds View in second, and Mounds View in first. Forensics Varsity, fourth place Eastview, third place Egan, second place Eden Prairie, and first place Mounds View. Fossils JV, third place YZ, second place Eden Prairie, First place, Mounds View. Fossils for Varsity. Fourth place, Woodbury. Third place, Mounds View. Second place, Moorhead. And first place, John Marshall. Geologic Mapping JV. Third place, Mounds View. Second place, Mounds View. And first place, Mounds View. In Geologic Mapping for Varsity. First place, or fourth place, I'm sorry, YZ. Third place, Tomeo. Second place, to Eden Prairie and first place to Century. Gravity Vehicle JV, third place, we didn't have any, second place Mounds View, and first place Eden Prairie. Gravity Vehicle for Varsity, East View in fourth, Apple Valley in third, Mounds View second, and St. Paul Academy in first. Helicopters JV, there was no third team, so second place Mounds View, and first place Holly. Helicopters for Varsity, Mounds View in fourth, East View third, Eden Prairie second, and Woodbury first. Machines for JV, third place to Mounds View, second place Mounds View, and first place YZ. Machines Varsity, fourth place Minnetonka, third place Eden Prairie, second place Mounds View, and first place Woodbury. Mystery Build, JV, third place Century, Second place, Mounds View, and first place, Mounds View. Mystery Build Varsity, fourth place, Woodbury, third place, Eden Prairie, second place, Orono, and first place, John Marshall. Ornithology, JV, third place, Eden Prairie, second place, Mounds View, first place, Mounds View. Ornithology for Varsity, Austin in fourth, Eden Prairie in third, Moorhead second, and YZ in first. Protein modeling for JV, Mounds View third, Eden Prairie second, and Mounds View first. Protein modeling varsity, Mounds View in fourth, Woodbury third, Lakeville South in second, and Minnetonka in first. Sounds of Music JV, YZ in third, second place Eden Prairie, and first place Mounds View. Sounds of Music varsity, Woodbury in fourth, Mounds View third, second place in Bayo, and first place to YZ. Water quality JV. We have Eden Prairie in third, Mounds View second, and Century in first. Water quality varsity. Fourth place to Century, third place Mayo, second place Mounds View, and first place YZ. Right at Cat it JV. Third place Century second place Holly, and first place Mounds View. Right at Cadet Varsity, Eden Prairie fourth, Woodbury in third, Egan in second, and YZ in first. All right, let's get to our team results. Um, just before we get to results, I do want everybody to know that um, if your name wasn't called in the top three or four for JV or Varsity, uh, we will send out the score, the official score sheet with all placements uh, following the awards presentation, I will also send coaches a link to this slide deck um, so you'll have access to the full result sheet. Um, for team results for JV, we are doing the top two JV teams and you will be receiving a trophy. Um, and then we will, let's see, we'll go talk about small schools. JV, uh, second place was Eden Prairie and first place went to Moundsview Krypton. 
Um, typically, we do a small school results. And so the top three small schools will receive a plaque um, for their um, for their placement in our state tournament. And typically we, we define a small school as having 700 or fewer students. So in third place for small schools was Sacred Heart, in second place, Wasika, and in first place, Holly. Congratulations. All right, for the varsity team results, we are going to show you the top 10. So we'll do 10th place through fourth place. Um, and I've also included the point values for each of those placings. Um, and then we will do the top three and the top three teams will receive a trophy. All right, in 10th place for varsity, we have Egan. Ninth place, St. Paul Academy. Eighth place, East, East Ridge. Seventh goes to Century. Sixth to East View. Fifth to Mayo and fourth place to Woodbury. For our top three, so the third place and second place teams will receive a trophy as will the first place team. The first place team does get to advance to the national tournament, which will be held uh, as the mini format. So much like we did our state tournament this year, um, Arizona State University is hosting the national tournament. Um, and the week of May 17th through 21st, so the week leading up to nationals, is actually going to be a STEM week. And so Arizona State University and the National Science Olympiad will be having panels and they will have workshops and other events for anybody within the Science Olympiad community to take part in. Um, coaches, in the email with the awards uh, results, I will also send you some information on three things that are going on right now, a team t-shirt design contest, and this is open to anybody, a founder scholarship and a coaching excellence award. And so I'll pass that information along if you'd like to forward that to your students at this time. So before I get to the top three, I do have to give you a little bit of information. Um, this is the first time that I've ever seen this happen, but there was a tie for first place. And so I just want to explain how that tie is broken before I give you the results. So when we calculate overall scores, the each team has their lowest score dropped from their overall points. In the event of a tie, what we do is we take that dropped score and we bring it back in to the team score. And whichever team has the lower of the scores, they get the first place bid. Okay, so hopefully that makes sense. If there's any questions, please feel free to reach out to me uh, following the awards presentation. So without further ado, in third place for 2021, we have Moundsview with 94 points. In second place, we have Wyzetta with 90 points. And the 2021 first place team this year goes to Eden Prairie with 90 points. And that, again, YZ and Eden Prairie had the tiebreaker. All right, everybody, thank you so much for joining. I can't tell you how excited I was to be able to host a Science Olympiad tournament for you this year. Um, I really doubted it in the fall, but I just, I'm so, so thankful we were able to pull this off. And we hope to see all of you back next year. Uh, and hopefully we'll be in person at that time. Thanks, goodbye.